Ladies and gentlemen of the school board, as educators, we need to teach our children about the history of racism. We've come a long way since my day, though there's still work to be done. But we must be careful and thoughtful. Any ideas? Oh, we, let's let's ideas. we got some ideas. <gasps> now wait just one minute. Who let these clan members in? Follow my lead, young clan. Well, hold on right now. You yourself. You want to teach kids about the history of racism? Can you think of someone more well-versed on the topic than, a, well, the two of us? Oh, yeah, sure. Let's hear what he has to say. Mm, I don't like it, but perhaps you would have some valuable insight. Fantastic. Okay, so, we all know the biggies. We got slavery, we got more slavery, we got the MLK, now we got the white privilege, but... But, get this, did you know that the history of racism doesn't need to be historical? Say oh, what I now? beg your pardon. history mystery. In today's landscape, you don't have to be historically accurate. You just need to be on the right side of it. And then you can make stuff up. What in the are you doing, boy? Shh, shh. So you mean I could teach my students that even though Abraham Lincoln helped free the slaves, he's, I don't know, still a racist? Of course you can't teach them that. Yeah, he ain't one up. Of course you can teach them that because Lincoln was white, benefited from white privilege, and is therefore racist. You got it. You cannot enter any circumstance teach a child of any race that simply being white makes you a racist? Yeah, yeah. Teaching that would be born a lot of bullshit to these here children. I can't believe I'm saying this, but I agree with this clansman. Yeah. <laughs> uh, okay, Mr. Caveman. <laughs> these guys think teaching kids about racism is abuse. A <laughs> couple of nuts over here. It's good that we're making stuff up. What else you got? Uh... We could teach kids that the only slaves in the history of the world were black. There's never been slaves of another color, something like that. Black people are the only true slaves? <laughs> I certainly won't argue with that. Mm, what if our curriculum taught that the civil rights movement was a sham? Preposterous! Sh shush, shush, shush! Let's hear them out! Because the civil rights movement wanted us to believe that white people and black people are equal? We are! <laughs> we most certainly are not because of white privilege. Sure. What if we taught kids that Obama doesn't count as the first black president because of his mixed race? <laughs> Who's got two thumbs and loves denying someone their identity for arbitrary reasons? This guy. We could teach kids that the Black Lives Matter organization is justified in everything they do, including violence. That's the right idea, but it's been done. Okay, then how about BLM should, like, use violence to take back land and segregate themselves from the evil white man so they never have to deal with white people ever again? I like half of that idea. That is it! I'm on to you! You're not doing this to teach kids about racism, you're doing it to lower the bar. To make it easier for people like you to make the world a hateful place. <laughs> Diluting my racism, well he does. Well, I won't stand for it. I'm not afraid of you. I won't let you fabricate history. <sighs> He's right. You shouldn't let me just pff, make stuff up. You're educators. I'm just a lowly old member of the Ku Klux Klan. Don't listen to me. Ah, thank you. Thank you. Instead, listen to Nicole Hannah-Jones. She showed that you can teach anything you want as long as you call it a reframing. That's what she did with the 1619 Project. Now we can reframe whatever we want. 1619 Project! 1619 Project! 1619 Project! Stop it! Stop chanting! This isn't racism! I know racism! I marched with Martin Luther King Jr. You hear that? This guy marched against Martin Luther King! I did He's racist! No such thing! That is not what I said! Hold on, I'm coming with you! I'm being framed! I'm being framed! No, you're being reframed. Oh, dang, that was funny. Man, that hit my funny bone right in the funny bone. Yeah, we're watching our own videos and saying they're funny. How cool is that? Uh, I mean, who does that? Who does that? So. We do that. Live action sketches, animation, podcasts. We have it all on the Babylon Bee YouTube channel. So we want you to subscribe to it so you can get notified. How do you get notified? Don't you have to click like a... I think there's a bell picture. A bell. And click the little bell. 